The tutorial before this was about the delays in the computer networks. Now we'll learn different examples of the delays of computer networks. So let us take one example where we have given the length of the packet is uh, 8 MB and the bandwidth is 1 MB per second. So we need to find what is the tra transmission delay of this example or we can say this topology. So transmission delay we derived that it was length of the packet divided by bandwidth. So what is the length of, length of the packet is 8 MB and what is the bandwidth is 1 MB per second. So the time taken for transmitting the, that packet is 8 seconds. Alright. Now we have given uh, length equals to 8 MB again and uh, bandwidth equals to 1 GB per second. Alright. So what will be the answer for the transmission delay will be first we need to convert to the same unit. Alright. So 8 MB upon 1 gbps so it will be 8 upon 1 into 1000 remember this will not be 1024 just because bandwidth is considered as a, you know it is measured in frequency so it will always be in the power of tens it will not be in power of 2 raised to something 2 raised to tens so the answer will be 8 by 1000 second now if you have given if you have given that the length of the packet is 8 MB again and the bandwidth is 10 KB per second alright so now we need to convert this into single unit means the same unit so the transmission delay will be 8 on 10 kbps alright so 8 MB will be 8 into 10 raised to I mean 2 raised to 10 that is 1024 upon 10 kbps so it will be 8 into 2 raised to 10 upon 10 seconds so this will be the transmission delay of this example or we can say this is topology you know length of the packet is always measured in terms of MBs that is in, in terms of bits so that's why we wrote in the terms of 2, uh, two raised to 10 right so now again uh, now next example will be of propagation delay now suppose we are given that the transmission link between sender and the receiver is optical fiber then what will be the velocity of the data transmission that will be 3 into 10 raised to 8 meter per second but in optical fibers the, the velocity is not fully uh, fully used it is only the 70% of it. So what will be the velocity? It will be 2.1 into 10 raised to 8 meter per second. Remember this thing. Until and unless you have given that the speed of the velocity is this, you should use this. That is the 70% of the total speed of light. Now uh, we have given that the distance between the sender and the receiver is 200 meters. So we discussed that the propagation delay is distance upon velocity that will be 200 meters upon 2.1 into 10 raised to 8 so the answer will be 2 into 10 raised to minus 6 upon 2.1 seconds so this was all about the examples of the uh, delays in computer networks we will not be discussing the examples of giving delay and processing delay just because, just because we don't have any you know mathematical formula for that so this was all the examples of delays, thanks for watching.